What's going on? It's Terry from WebSpark, and today I want to do a quick demo on color calibrating your projector. This demo is an extension of my previous video where I calibrated my PC monitor, so if you haven't seen that yet, there's a link in the description. For this demo, I'm using the SilverTicket 120 inch projector screen and the BenQ W1080ST home theater projector. Links to all the products will be in the description below. Before we start, there's a few things to note in this calibration. Your projector needs to be connected to your PC, the calibration is done on your PC, and the color profile will be set on your PC. This means that if your projector is not displaying content through your PC, it will not be displaying that color profile. Now let's get started. To begin with, we will need a tripod, a long USB cable, and the color calibrator. We will be using the X-Ray i1 Display Pro. Mount the calibrator on the tripod. Position the tripod as close to the screen as possible. Connect the USB to your PC. Make sure the lighting in the room is the same as when you're going to use your projector. Also make sure the projector is on for at least 30 minutes to give it time to warm up. Let's fire up the software. Make sure you've selected projector calibration and choose the display for your projector. For the white point I'll be choosing D65, tone response curve to standard and gamma to 2.2. The patch set size to large and click start. The calibration will take around 5 to 10 minutes. Once done, we need to load up the new profile for our projector. To do this, go to color management from the control panel, select the display for our projector, click on the color profile we just created and click on set as default profile to apply the settings. The projector is now displaying content using the new color profile. Let's do a quick before and after comparison. So this was a quick demo on calibrating a projector. There are some limitations on this method like not being able to use the same color profile for other devices like the PS4 or the Xbox. If anyone knows how this can be done, please let us know in the comments. I hope this video has helped you learn something new. If so, please hit that like button. If you want to see more videos like these, please hit subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.